Hello, I'm Jackson Dieterle, and this is my Bulldog story. I was born in Grand Rapids, Michigan. We lived there for about four years, five years, and then we moved to Jenison, which is about 20 minutes outside of Grand Rapids. I have a twin brother who goes to Central Michigan. He plays soccer there, and I have a little brother who is a freshman in the professional golf management program here at Ferris. Once we moved to Jenison, um, I started playing soccer. Got, got into that sport, and that, that's kind of what I played my whole life. Played soccer, basketball, baseball, and then football, obviously. Pretty gifted athletically, I would say, when I was a kid. Um, I ended up playing a year up for soccer on my AAU team. Once I got towards junior high, I stopped playing club and just started playing for school more. It's pretty special being on a college football team. Uh, it's definitely, the, the football fraternity is a real thing, and to be a part of that 2% or whatever, however many high school athletes go on to play at the next level, it's really special, and it's just a testament to how hard I've worked to get to this point. I would say what separates our football team from every other program in the country is the fact that we treat it like a family. Like, everyone on our team is, is your brother, and that's how you treat them, and you know, when freshmen come in, they're treated like little brothers by the seniors in a good way. You know, we're, we're helping the freshmen get to classes, giving them rides, um, supporting them with whatever they need. My major here is hospitality management with a focus in food and beverage industry management. My parents cook a lot and always just encouraged us to, you know, be in the, be in the kitchen and like provide for yourself, I guess. Um, and, you know, I, I took that as cooking as a way that I can express myself and relax and, you know, it's kind of art in a way. Um, so I, I just feel like it's, it's something that I can express myself with. Going into the national championship, I knew that I just had to put everything that had happened this season behind me. I played the first seven games of the year injured, um, so that was really tough to overcome that and just kind of get into a groove. And in the playoffs, I think I made five or six field goals. And the 52-yarder, the obviously, to cap it off was, was a really cool experience. And, you know, it's a memory that I'll never forget. Some advice that I would give people coming into Ferris would be definitely stay in the classroom, stay in the library, get close with your teachers and develop a, a personal relationship with them because they're here to help you and the more personal you are with them, the more willing they are going to be to help you. Um, and for athletes, you know, all that stuff's ten times more important. You need, to, you need to get in with your teachers and let them know, hey, I'm going to miss some class because of this obligation that I have. You know, going to office hours and and asking questions is, are all great things that will lead you to, the, to success here. After Ferris, I'm thinking about going to culinary school. Um, I don't know where. Uh, I definitely want to get out of Michigan and out of the Midwest. I kind of want to see the, the United States a little bit. Um, but my ideal job would uh, be to be someone's personal chef or to own my own restaurant for sure. <laughs>